guys so today I'm going to show you how to make a basketball jersey with place its templates so the first thing you have to do is go to apparel print hover over it and here you'll find the jersey mock-ups tab you click on it and it'll show you a bunch of different jersey templates that you can use but today we're gonna do basketball so I'll scroll down and I'll find the one that I want. The one that I want, I think, is on the second page. Let's see if I can find it. Uh, there's a really cool kid who's playing basketball around here somewhere. Here it is. Okay. So, it's super easy to show your team colors with these, these templates. And... There's a bunch of different things that you can do with them. One of them is taking them to the printers and showing them exactly how you want your uniform to look because sometimes some things are off, the communication is off, but having a visual statement of what you want is, is a great thing to have. Um, also, you can get your players hyped up for next season and show them how awesome they'll look in their new uniform. So, okay, let's, go, let's get on to the, the actual designing. So here we have a lot of options that we can use. And the first one is we can change the player numbers. So let's go with 42. Um, and let's let that load. We can change the font. So this one is graduate and it's varsity-ish. So I think that's good. And we can also change the color, but we'll get to that in a second. Now, we already have a logo. We designed it in last video where we made a, a basketball logo that we can use. So let's see. I think I have one around here. Yes, here it is. And with these uh, templates, the cool thing is that you can make it bigger. You can make your logo a little bit bigger if it's not big enough. Just be careful to not go all the way up because that's going to crop it. So if we go there, I think that's going to be fine. We click enter and we wait for it to load just takes a second and there it is nice and big in the center so this template in particular you can also have the logo on the shorts so let's upload that right there and let's click enter and we can make it a little bit bigger as well so you can see it from all sides of the court there we go, enter. And there you're going to have the logo on the shorts. Now, um, let's change the color of the number, the team number. Um, I think if we go with this one, it's going to be fine. And see, it matches, perfect. Now, if we go to jersey color, we can change this and let's go to black because black and and green always look nice together so I think that's a little bit too dark we can click more and we can make it a little bit lighter so the cool thing about this this hex number is that if you already have the color code for your team you can just get that from maybe your designer whoever uh, helps you with that and you can paste it right here and that way you'll have the exact same color you use now let's see you could choose and that looks a lot better and then uh, we, we can change the color of the shorts so for the shorts um, let's see how this one looks okay I think they're a little bit too dark so let's go one shade lighter and now I'm looking at the number and I think it's a little bit too dark as well. So we can still change it. We can go over here and we can change it to the same color of the shorts. And now they match and they look perfect together. And finally, this sample has the compression shorts color too. So I think we could go with the same color as the jersey. So we just have to copy this and paste it over here. Click enter, and there you have it. 
all of the colors. And this kid is, looks like he's about to shoot. Now, this is the template. And it's super easy to use, as I just showed you. For the logo, we have a logo maker. So if you don't have a designer to make your logo, you can make a, a logo with our logo maker and it's going to come out awesome. We have a bunch of different options for you to design it. You don't need any Photoshop or design tools, so that makes it super easy and anyone can use it. Um, so yeah, the full tutorial is on the blog. So you can also check it there. So before, before we're done, we haven't downloaded it, of course. So we just click download and you'll get a PNG image and it's only $8, so that's a great price. You click here and it's going to ask you to sign up, but there you have it. So that's the tutorial for today. If you have any questions at all, leave them in the comments. We'll check them and we'll answer them as soon as possible. And I hope you liked it. Uh, we're going to be having more of these tutorials soon. And check out Placeit because we have many cool things to show you. Thank you so much for watching, guys. And see you next time. Bye.